Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some good old yarny talk. Good morning, this is Pamela, and you're on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. Welcome to my channel, and I'd just like to say thank you for everyone for coming back and watching my videos. I appreciate that. Uh, just grab you something to drink. I'm drinking good old black coffee this morning. Um, the weather is nice outside. <laughs> uh, if you remember, I have a window now and um, the light's coming in on me and I am loving it. <laughs> okay, so today's video is not about me and not what I've done necessarily. A little bit, but not much. It's mostly about you. Um, this video is all about the hashtag cro uh, towel topper crochet along. The hashtag, I think it's hashtag towel topper C-A-L or even hashtag towel, towel topper, however you want to say it. Anyway, so this month um, for April, um, I just want to say you guys have went way out and beyond. I mean, it is, I am so impressed with all of the towels that you have made. Um, I just want to say, um, you. this is my first crochet long, and so I am just blown away about how much enthusiasm they there is for this uh, crochet along and I'm just so excited over it and what the crochet along is if you are new and this is your first time catching this video then what it is is we are making uh, one of one of these towel toppers a month and I'll explain how it works real quick um, you just buy your towel Dollar Tree Dollar General Walmart Kohl's TJ Maxx anywhere that you'd like to buy a towel you cut the towel in half so that you get two towels out of it, and you just crochet this towel topper on top of it and add you a button. And I will leave the link below of the tutorial on how to do this. And the goal is, is to make one a month so that by the end of the year, you will have 12 towels, hand towels, to give out as a gift. Now, there's so many different ways that you can do this. Um, I am making four a month. And so, because I have four ladies in my life that I would like to give some towels to. So, I'm making mine theme-related. Um, some months it may not be themed because, like, in May, and there's there's a few months that I just don't know what to do, <laughs> to be honest. So, I'm just going to have something pretty. Um, but anyway, so the thing is, you make at least one a month. At the end of the year, you will have 12 gifts to give. You can give one per person, or you can give all 12 to one person. My goal is I'm making four a month and each of my four recipients will get 12 and they because they will be theme related. That's all you do. So you can jump in anytime you want. You don't have to have, you can just start making these, uh, posting it in Facebook group page. I will put your video, I mean, your picture in the slideshow. Um, it doesn't matter how many you actually make. It, you know, it's just, you don't even have to do one a month, even if you just do three. When you do your three, post them because I'm going to have a slideshow every month for the rest of the year and showcase all the towels that y'all make for that month. Okay, so jump in anytime. You know, you can make however many you want. It depends on how many gifts you want to get. So I will leave the tutorial on how to do this. All right, before I show mine off, because I'll show mine off uh, here in just a second, I want to showcase what you guys have made. All the, um, let's see, all of the hard work that you've gone through, all of the, because you, I know by seeing the towels, you've had to do some, done a lot of shopping to try to find some of the cutest towels you can find. And um, the towel, the colors that you're making for the tops, oh my gosh, y'all are just blowing me away with all the pretty colors that y'all are picking. Uh, you can use cotton, acrylic, whatever you want. That's up to you. Um, okay, so let's check out the video of all of you guys' hard work.
I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did. Uh, like I said, I am blown away with all of the participation in this crochet along, and it just warms my heart that you guys are as excited about this crochet along as I am. Um, and it's, it is going to make Christmas a little less stressful when the time comes because you're going to have all these gifts to give someone. <laughs> okay, so here are the ones that I have for April. This one right here. I love this color of yarn. It's like a salmon color. And this here is one of my favorites. Oh, yeah, and it has some little fringe at the bottom. I think I got this one at um, um, Joann's. See, you can buy them anywhere. There's this one. And we have this one. So those are the ones that I have. So each of the ladies will get a um, theme-related one for that month. And I am taking mine a step farther because I am making a pair of slippers for my mom. I do have a tutorial for this. This is a very easy pattern uh, tutorial. You can uh, make this from a child all the way up to an extra large. But I am making my mom a pair of slippers every month, and I'm making them theme-related. My mother and my sisters, and including me, we love these slippers. So here is what I made. There we go. Very simple. I just put a little cuff on them. See how easy, how, look at that. So I've been making this pattern for years. And so I went ahead and did a tutorial for you guys so that uh, y'all can make them. So, you know, if you want to add the little extra for someone, that's fine. Um, you know, if you don't want to do, give a person 12 of these, uh, you know, just make one here or there, you know. But I'm doing a little extra for my mother because she loves these. Um, okay, so I guess I can show you, this is what I was thinking about. I think this one right here. I was thinking about doing my mom a pair of slippers for May in May. Uh, this I love this yarn right here. I was thinking of doing it in this color because it's so pretty and it's just feminine, you know, kind of rosy like, you know. And uh, this is Hobby Lobby. The color is Wild Carnation. Um, but my mom is a little low on slippers, so I'm actually going to make her two pair. One I'm just going to give her now, and then the other one will be, you know, for Christmas. But the other one is, I love this yarn, and it's this one right here. And it's a little bit more pastel looking. And uh, this one is called uh, Sweet Serenade. So I'm going to make my mom a pair in that one. So that will be like for now, but this one will be, if I decide on this, this one will be for her... Um, Christmas gift. Now, the two towels that I picked out for May that I'm thinking about doing are these two right here. So, I'm not quite sure yet, but see how you just, um, you just split it in half, take a pair of scissors, and just cut right down the center right here. Now, some of these, there's words on one side, but not the other. I don't think the people would care. I wouldn't. If someone gave me a towel with just this part and a topper on it, I would never have known that there was words on it. So I wouldn't care. <laughs> and even if I did know, I still wouldn't care. <laughs> I mean, because it's a beautiful towel. But that's all you do. You just cut it in half and that makes two towels. And then you just do your base stitch right here and just watch the tutorial. I'll show you how to do it in the tutorial. Um, someone suggested getting an awl uh, to kind of poke your hose for your first row. And I did that, and I do like that. So I will probably continue doing that. It's an AWL. I'll leave a little, it's like $2.99, $3.99. I can't remember now, but you can get them at Walmart. Uh, I bought mine on Amazon. I'll leave the link just in case you're interested in it. But see, like this person here, one person will get the fringe and one won't. I really don't think the people will care, and they will never know. Anyway, they're going in different households. The four ladies that uh, will be getting these, they all live separately. So, <laughs> you know, and like I said, they're sweet ladies. They would never care if someone had friends and the other one didn't. So, okay. So that um, I'm so excited about. I hope that you guys um, are as excited about this crochet alone as I am. I was so excited to get to show off um, all the things, all the towel toppers that you guys have made and that you posted in the Facebook group page. I was so excited to put this slideshow together to show off all of y'all's hard work. So I look forward to seeing um, what all you guys do for the next month. So keep it up. <laughs> I will see you in my next video. Bye. 
Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.